We will demonstrate how quick and easy it is to set up the Autojet 1550 Plus Modular Spray System's touchscreen parameters. Turn on the power switch at the bottom of the control panel and open the door. First, set the duty cycle. The duty cycle is the amount of time the nozzle spray during each cycle. The spray time is how flow rate is controlled. For example, a duty cycle of 50% provides a flow rate that is half the maximum flow of the nozzle. We'll set the duty cycle at 35%. Then we will set the start and stop delay times, which is the amount of time the nozzle spray before or after the system triggered. This is helpful in instances where the sensor is downstream from the spray station to ensure full coverage to the target. Next, we will set the timing mode in the setup menu. We want continuous spraying, so we will choose repeat as the timing mode. We will set the anticipator time to 3 tenths of a second. This is the amount of time the air is on before the liquid goes through the nozzles. This will prevent any dripping at the beginning of a spray cycle. The follower time controls the length of time the air remains on after the liquid is turned off. This prevents dripping at the end of the spray cycle. Here we set it to 2 tenths of a second. The max frequency allows the user to manually set the maximum spray cycles per minute. By setting this lower than the nozzle's maximum number of cycles per minute, nozzle wear is reduced. Here we set it to 2500. Next, we will select from the drop-down the type of trigger being used. The options are local, which is an on-off button on the touchscreen as seen here, or remote, which uses a sensor to recognize when product is present. Now we will select whether or not the system is equipped with a liquid level sensor which alerts you if your liquid tank or tote is running low by sending an error message to the screen, sounding an alarm, or turning on a warning light. The interval settings controls the time the spray is on or off while the system is triggered. The diagnostic screen shows key system info, like trigger activation, analog input values, and more, which is useful when troubleshooting or setting up a new system. Using the diagnostic screen allows you to see if adjustments should be made to spray parameters, such as duty cycle. If a change is necessary, it can be made on the fly while the system is operating. You've just seen the simple and quick steps to program your Autojet 1550 Plus modular spray system. For more detailed instructions, please consult the owner's manual or contact your local spray expert at 1-800-95-SPRAY.